morning on my mind From a heart it's fairly well Sunday morning on my mind Down that lonesome trail Sunday morning on my mind From a heart it's fairly Hmm. Yeah, I haven't played it in a while. It's been a, uh, not to give away the secret here, but I haven't really been playing a lot out this year, so. <laughs> as one could guess. So, um, I'll break it up and do some blues stuff here. This is an old jazz song I learned. Uh, uh, just travel around, go down to New Orleans and other, hear other records and stuff like that. And uh, this is an old song. Everybody, everybody's done this song. It's been converted to cowboy music, pop songs and everything though. But uh, I figured, uh, I just really always liked this song. So I'm going to do it. This is an old one called Ain't Nobody's Business. One of these days now, I'm going crazy. I'm gonna take a shotgun and I'm gonna shoot my old lady. It ain't nobody's business what I do. If I'm in the cabaret all night on Sunday. Then you find me in the church pew all oh, come Monday. But it ain't nobody's business what I do. If I start now, act a little funny, I'm gonna walk around and I'm gonna spend all my money. But ain't nobody's business what I do. If I want to take an ocean, I'm gonna walk on down and I'm gonna jump in that ocean. But ain't nobody's business what I do. All those people that now want to criticize me, I'm going to do what I want and they're still going to despise me. But ain't nobody's business what I do. That's an old song, baby. That's an old one. I want to keep it going. I'll just now I'm gonna go from New Orleans to uh, let's just call it West Virginia, huh? So because uh, that was a little bit of some New Orleans old jazz, and now I'm gonna go up to some Poor Valley. Uh, I think the Carter family did this song. It's just an old, old religious song. Uh, you could hear it in the Smoky Mountains down south or any kind of in that territory, but uh, 
very God-fearing song if you're into that kind of thing. I just happen to like the melody and the riff. But uh, you know, we all can't have different, we can have our faith different places if you want to put it in different places. <laughs> Satan, your kingdom must come down. Well, I heard the voice of Jesus say, Satan, your kingdom must come down. Shout until they tear your kingdom down. Well, I heard the voice of Jesus say, Satan, your kingdom must come down. kingdom must come down well I heard the voice of Jesus say well, Satan your kingdom must come down <laughs> gotta get the gotta get the quarantine off I gotta rust and take it all off it was a long year I was supposed to go on a tour and all that kind of stuff this year but just like every other good musician, or not good, but every other musician, um, yeah, man, I got sidelined with the COVID thing, so I didn't get it, but just took out the rest of the world, and uh, it's a bummer, but, you know, I'm very fortunate that I was still able to have a job and work from home, and my wife was taken care of and everything like that, so, um, so I feel bad for all the guys I know that depend on that, that money on the road, and hopefully next year things, things will be a little bit better. We'll see. I have faith. Like an idiot, I have faith. <laughs> um, ah, it's the end of the year and it's Christmas. Let's try something completely wild here. I wrote this one. I'm working on a new record of very old-timey kind of things and uh, some finger-picking stuff. So uh, forgive me if I mess this one up and whatever. But uh, it's Christmas. It's on the house, right? This song uh, is called uh, Gypsy Woman.
don't secret love that molds your hand. Give your blessing, I'm at your command. Tired and weary, I'll be on my way. But your sweet love, no, I can't keep away. Gypsy woman, love that life of sin. Fire fingers, let your love begin. Ease my burdens and make me feel brand new. Side with me, baby. And I side with you yeah I've never played that before in my life and I was like let's just do it I'm still working out a little bit so one of those two notes were on the house because I'm still kind of feeling it out but uh yeah I like that I like that song so I'm gonna work on that a little bit more um uh let's, let's play another original of mine and then uh just keep it moving here, so. I usually, I used to call this song every Neil Young song you've ever heard, but uh, it's actually got a title for it and everything. It's called The Rusted Color Rain. There's another one I haven't played in a while, so uh, again, it's the holidays. Let's have some fun. Get my pick there. <laughs> Take upon my loneliness and send me on my way. And I see you standing there in the rust and color rain. Well, can a woman still want love when she gives up a throne? Darkness and dream in the great unknown will take upon my happiness and put my feet on the ground. Your voice has a song to sing, but it makes no sound. Can a woman still want love? Which gives up a throne to hear the wind blow, not for what it wants. Ooh, child, come with me, take what you want, and go and be free. Wave your hands on the diamond sky and lay your burden down. Take upon my loneliness and send me on my way. And I see you standing there in the rusty color rain. 
<laughs> you got to do your thing? Oh, yeah, you're up. Go ahead, yeah. I was going to come up and visit you. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> that was really sweet. So we were talking a little bit during sound check, and so you've been doing some writing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, um, yeah, is there follow-up? <laughs> no, uh, 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 no, I was... Um, I had an album I was going to put out this year, and um, I've been telling, like, the best, best way to describe it is that I was listening back to it and uh, some of the stuff that I did on it, and it's not the fault of any of the musicians. I had fantastic musicians and great talent on the, on the record, and, and Eric Ritter up at Windmill Studio who helped record and engineer it and everything. Um, I was just not... It just my heart and my head were not in it anymore, and I, and I came to the realization it's easier to say, what am I doing, than what have I done? So I kind of sidelined 90% of the record, and I was kind of thinking about what do I really like, what am I really passionate about, and, and where do I want to go with what I'm doing here? And I was like, Basically, now what I'm doing right here is just the traditional music, very stripped back. I mean, I'm still about all instrumentation and having mm. arrangements on records and stuff, though. But um, I'm in the next month or two, I'm going to go make a traditional folk record with some originals of, of mine as well. So, yeah, writing, yeah. <laughs> it's great. You're writing the your your new stuff. Your new song that you just did was really great. Oh, the the gypsy one. Yeah. 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 Really nice. Uh, yeah, I, I had that sitting around for like. I want to say like two years, and I was always kind of like, that's fun. And, you know, it, 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 turned, into, um, it turned into one of those things where my wife was like, that's interesting. And it turned into, hey, that's a pretty good song. Then it turned into, still playing that, huh? <laughs> so yeah, hopefully I'll, I'll, I'll be able to put it out. And you've been doing some fingering and some... Some yeah, I've been, picking. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I was always into that thing, and I was always into doing cross picking and 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 Travis picking and and, and flat picking is like the the bluegrass that that thing. Um, I always could do it, and I always liked doing it, but I never wanted to. I don't think I, I don't think I had enough confidence in myself to finally go down the road of like uh, make that my home kind of a thing yeah. and I, I kind of steered more towards the straight like singer songwriter picking like just strumming thing but I was like nope I got nothing to do I'm working from home I don't feel like playing video games so I just got just practiced it and just, just kept doing it I think a lot of us have been taking this time to rethink what we've been doing and wh where we want to go and, yeah yeah and, yeah, and it, like, I definitely yeah you know, it, it's I don't know it's like almost selfish to say and it's almost you, you almost don't want to say it, but like on a personal level, you're like, like I had a, it was a, it was a very bad year and I made the best of it. And it's like, I, I had some focus moments of like that. So in the midst of the, the tragedy that is 2020, I was like, now I'm going to save what I can. Out but of it, that's so. all we can do in times like these, you know, we have to support each other and do what we can. And here we are, you yeah. know, I'm thrilled to, be down here tonight with Sean Flynn, and we'll, uh, you're, you're going to be joined very shortly yeah. by John Higgins. Looking forward to that. Uh, for those of you that are just tuning in, uh, we're at Underground Microphone downstairs in the Raymond Hood Room. We do this every Tuesday. Normally, we do this uh, to a live audience, uh, but we've been lucky enough to be able to do this virtually during these times. So um, you might see some donation information uh, strolling across the bottom of the screen. Um, if you're so inclined, we'd uh, certainly appreciate your support. Uh, this program is partially funded by the Overlook Estate Foundation, and we're very thrilled to have that support. So any support is greatly appreciated. So, Sean, what up, what up next? What's up? Uh, I think I'm going to do a song I put out, actually, this year. And, uh, and then you'll be bringing John Yeah, up. I'll just yeah. do two more, one or two more, whatever you want, man. I mean, We're like, at the halfway point soon, so, yeah. Sounds maybe good. I'll just maybe I'll just end on this note then. I think maybe I should end on a note of myself then, ending on one of my songs instead of. You just play. I'll just play. I'll just play. Yeah. I'll just play. I put this song out. So uh, if you like this song, this is gonna be on the record I'm gonna be making. I've been saying that for a year and a half now, but I'm really gonna do it. And uh, this song is out on Spotify, Bandcamp, and everything like that. It's a really cool song, and it was meant to be on something else, but I, I'm, I'm confident what it's gonna be. And so it's a nice little folk duet song. 
uh, but I'm going to just do it by myself tonight. So, uh, yeah, maybe I'll just end on this one, and uh, I like I think I like ending on my own song here tonight. So, uh, thanks for listening, and again, my name's Sean Flynn, and uh, I play under American Buffalo Ghost. Check me out, Facebook, Instagram, and uh, all that good stuff, and hopefully I'll see you next year. And if you got a zip code, I'll be there because I want to get back on the road. So, so thanks for hanging out. That's it. I'm going home. <laughs> this, is, this is normally where I think I would say give it up for Sean Flynn, American Buffalo Ghost, but there's no audience, so yeah. fantastic job. Uh, the new song is, is awesome. Love that one. Love the last one. Oh, thanks, buddy. I was hoping I wasn't going to mess it up, but I was like, I got it. I've only been playing four times this year. stuck in my head. What one? Your song. The last one. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. 
my name is John, uh, John Higgins. I am the singer and guitar player of, an, of a band that I started right before quarantine called Retrovi. Um, if you want to look us up, R-E-T-R-O-V-A-I. Uh, it kind of goes hand in hand with the first song that I'm going to play. Um, it's sort of a, a French word that I stumbled across on the internet, as all musicians do when they're coming up with band names. And uh, the first song that I'm going to play is called, uh, it's, it's a quote, it's the definition of retrovi. It's called uh, The Joy of Reuniting with Someone After a Long Separation. Uh, I've been trying to take this project and write more, more meaningful stuff and, and describe more emotions and sort of get better with words because I, I think that I could challenge myself in that department. So, uh, so yeah, this first song is, uh, is that. Lose myself in the music. You're the only thing in focus. Well, I was scared he'd gone astray, that things would never feel the same again. But all that disappears the more I give. From the distance, such an unessential flaw. You're holding on to things that you know you don't want. You try to make these pieces fit like they're the others, but they don't. Thank you very much. <clears throat> so I'm going to play a couple older ones as well. Uh, for a few years I did uh, some solo music on, uh, on YouTube. Um, was doing about an original song every month, just trying to put some stuff out there. Uh, this is one of the last ones that I did. Um, this one always seemed to be pretty fun to play. Uh, this is a song called I'm Not Okay. I'm 
remember long before this scene I was happier than the man that you all can see Turn the page, now I'm 22 and miserable as hell And I talk in circles so that you can see that I'm not well I did it to myself Oh, I'm stuck inside this cell well, I'm not okay And I haven't been for days Maybe months, maybe years That's how long I felt so messed up Didn't ask to feel this way Think I might need God or drugs To help me pick myself back up Well, I'm the cause of all these problems in my life Cause I don't know how to shut my mouth And let the past just die And I'm sorry that I drug you all along For the ride But I've got another song I wish I didn't have to write I do this to myself Oh, stuck inside this Okay, and I haven't been for days, maybe months, maybe years. It's how long I felt so messed up. Well, I can't explain. I didn't ask to feel this way. Think I might need God or drugs to help me pick myself back up. Well, I don't know where I've been going wrong. some time to find out who I am Just a broken man Well, I'm not okay And I haven't been for days Maybe months, maybe years It's how long I felt so messed up Well, I can't explain I didn't ask to feel this way Think I might need God or drugs to help me pick myself back up. To help me pick myself back up. To help me pick myself back up. Thank you guys. That song was always pretty cool. Um, in my mind, it was sort of like an oxymoron, happy music, sad lyrics. Um, that was a favorite of mine when I was doing the solo stuff. Um, I actually forgot to pull my set list out, so I'm going to do that right now. <laughs> okay. Uh, this next song is, uh, is another darker one. I'm, I'm happy to say, though, that through quarantine, I've been writing happier stuff for Retrovi, so a bunch of new music in the latter part of this set, but I'll play another older one that was a little bit darker, maybe a little bit, you know, that I've, that I've grown from and aged from, but uh, this is a song called Haunted. I've been stuck inside this mess, shame to say it's mine. And I've said sorry way too much, that now I don't even try. And I've been waiting for so long for this to heal with time, yeah. I don't know who said it would, but 
that's what I'm prescribed. Yeah. Yeah. I'm haunted by the things I do and say. That's a lousy way to live, but I'm alive today. Yeah, I know I made mistakes, but it's my life. Till I realized it was so much more than mine. Now I'm not trying to run away from all the pain, no. Sometimes I feel so alone from all the hate, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm haunted by the things I do and say. That's a lousy way to live, but I'm alive today. Haunted by the things I say and do Look around and wonder what the hell did I do Just a quick thanks, I guess, on, on my behalf. Thank you for having me tonight, Sean and Maria. Um, Thank you. Super glad that I could make it out, because like Sean said, really not a whole lot of shows going on this year. So I did a live stream on my Instagram a couple of weeks ago, and that was fun. Um, but it's nothing like getting out and playing for people. Um, but this is still a blast. And just being able to like debut some of the new music that, that you know maybe I've been sitting on or Sean's been sitting on. And, um, it's nice to be able to like put those out into the world, at least some tangible way um, that maybe somebody will hear it and go, oh, that was pretty good, or, hey, that sucked. Um, <laughs> but something, some sort of feedback. Uh, uh, what is there, no such thing as bad press? The, at least we have that going for us. So, um, All right, so this is, a, this is one of the upbeat songs that I did as a solo artist before I get into some of the new band stuff. Um, I don't play this one very often, so uh, sort of like Sean said, please forgive me if I, if I give you a couple notes or take a few notes away. Um, this song is called Get Back Up. You could find it on everywhere, I think, Apple Music, Spotify, YouTube. Hide me from the world and keep me sane I don't know if I like being sane I don't know or think that I'm insane
So on to some new stuff. Uh, as for Retrovi, we put out our first song, uh, the single that was the first song I did tonight. You could find that everywhere. Um, but we've been trying to piece together the EP. Uh, we had a couple songs started, but unfortunately quarantine and um, some of the guys living uh, in Bloomsburg and one of them being in Philly, it's, it's a little bit hard to get together for tracking and to do it safely and um, sort of above, above board right now. So. We've been sending voice memos back and forth to each other, um, trying to piece together the songs, uh, recording them on our own. Um, and I'm going to play you a couple of them uh, that I just finished this week. Um, so this isn't one of those, but it is a song that I've only ever played once before. Uh, this song <coughs> I actually wrote about my fiance, Sarah. So this song goes out to her. Um, but this song is called Back to You. And I'll follow you to the other side The brighter side of life That I've been missing for what seems like a lifetime the Morning light, it cuts through the pines I'm lost, lost, lost in your eyes Don't know how I ever lived without you Dodging, wanting, missing, thinking of you Is this too good to be true That I can finally call you mine A Little dress and red lipsticks Got me mesmerized Beneath these city lights The room is loud But all I see chose the truth to get back to you Until we met again Maybe the rooftops where you told me not to leave That was the moment when I knew where I should be Chose the truth. 
Tom, that's a beautiful song. Thank you. <laughs> really nice. Thank you very much. Well, I wanted to hop up real quick because um, for, those, for, for those of you that know, that come um, every week when, well, when we were able to have live audiences, um, you know that this room is a unique setting and nurtures new projects and um, original, yeah. like originality too. So it's perfect. What yeah. you're doing right now is perfect for what hey, we, awesome. what we th that's what this room is designed for, yeah. really. Um, we would just want to thank everybody for tuning in. Um, we're here now with the second part of the, well, we're into the second half of the show. We're almost done. Where John Higgins is here doing his originals. And um, just wanted to remind you that we're not here next week or the week after. We'll be back. We're, oh, by the way, happy holidays, everyone. I hope everybody has a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Be safe. Enjoy yourselves, but please be safe. Uh, we'll be back on January 12th. January is going to be a really fun month. We've got a lot of surprises for you. But on January 12th is uh, Mitch Evans from Anytime Soon. And I'm sure that if we're good boys and girls, he'll play some of his new stuff. That's actually, he just recorded um, his video from his uh, single, Jelly, what is it? Jelly, Jelly Donut Season. Um, nice. They filmed that upstairs <laughs> on the main stage. So it's really cool. So he's going to be doing a solo uh, version of of his new music. So we're Very looking cool. forward to that. So January 12th, tune in nice. then. So there back you. to John Higgins. Yeah, you're gonna Thank you very much. finish yeah, out got, the night with your stuff. Three more here for you and we'll, right. we'll wrap up and you know, have a good rest of our week and holiday, I think. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, Merry Christmas everybody. Back Very to John cool. Higgins. <clears throat> All right, so keeping with, the, keeping with the significant other songs tonight, I think tonight, Sean. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do another one. I just finished this one this week. Uh, this is a song called When We Were Young. Uh, it's sort of, uh, I guess, an origin story of, of my fiance and I uh, meeting and, and sort of getting to where we are at this point. So this is, uh, this is a brand new one. Main Street, I'm ordering another pair of drinks. I know you're three months shy of 21. Bum another cigarette from the singer of some local band. You light it, and I'm trying to keep up. Looking back ain't always fair. The 
It just depends on who was there And I can't wait to say when we were young uh, Thank you guys. What do you think, one more? Yeah? Cool. Yeah, we're going to do clap, yeah. All right. All right. This is the one I just finished a few days ago, so... These are the last couple are going to be new songs for my band Retrovi whenever we get the album done here, barring quarantine, uh, hopefully in the new year. This song is called Hugh. I'm John Higgins. That was Sean Flynn, American Buffalo Ghost. Thank you again for having us.